okay hey what's up guys so it's uh, my day out here and uh, I've already checked out now I'm finally saying goodbye to my home so let me just hold this for me bro please kind so okay. I'll be going to home so and, uh, this thing is so heavy <laughs> I don't know how it has been those all countries it's like I'm packing it's, it's over 20 pages I think <laughs> so I'm carrying a, like carrying a whole a whole baby mm -hmm. just arrange myself like, hey guys so I just packed my stuffs and uh, everything is just nice so I'm just cool I just say goodbye to this area right here it's just evening and I just came from the Aras far end over there so finally Cloud Joseph let me check no this route going this way the other side is so dusty so I have to take this route over here which might be so cool and so amazing and the sun is scorching it's evening time so I have to take a direct train from uh, Mombasa uh, direct to Nairobi Terminus then from Nairobi Terminus I can have a bus 10 hours straight to my village and uh, yeah Mombasa has been cool but now it was not that much favoring because it was kind of raining 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 and I never did it the well what was it but also feeling each and every single time severe headache i don't know what i don't know what so i was like oh so this is the time to say goodbye to this beautiful uh, area and now we're moving to another destination let me know at the comment section what did you love most about uh, about this area where i was mostly in the beach and other places that i've shown you so hello how are you you good okay this area residential is called mogadishu it's called mogadishu the tallest building that you see behind us there it's called mogadishu building the reason why it's called mogadishu building uh it's more of the somalis live actually there these all areas it's more of the somalis <laughs> these guys i'm giving you a small history when you come to this area you tend to know that oh I want to go to Magadishu or to this place and also actually I want to give a big shout out oh the sun is scorching nice okay and I want to give a best big shout out to where I was staying it's called Azuri Azuri homestay I'll definitely leave our uh, dear links down below if you want to be staying in this area kindly kindly if you want to be staying in this area please be sure to book it's one of the areas home say very nice and very nice friendly people actually you know so yeah it's called azuri homestay and this area is actually most of the pushy but with us the low class maybe let me say the travelers we can afford to we can afford ah, most of the plants here you tend to see are uh, the cocoa so the co 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 hugo, coconut juice or coconut trees or palm trees we have a biggest mo mosque on the other side let me be careful this guy cannot knock me on the other side where you see the far end right there we have a mosque on this end so some people give it okay so mostly let me go to the hotel first um, i want to go have some dish an evening dish because I'm going to take a, a night train from Mombasa direct to Nairobi city the second uh, the first capital city remember this is the second capital city that is Mom Mombasa so I'll be heading to the second capital city uh, the first capital city that is Nairobi yeah and uh, I'll be showing you how amazing it is it really is oh my goodness so I wanna go there and eat some best meat. Maybe. 
So you see top security here guys, this is the gate. Mombasa is literally hot because of the ocean. Yeah, because of the ocean, we say. We say so, because of the ocean. And then, afterwards, sometimes it's raining, raining, raining crazily. But, uh, it has been one of the greatest things, so, hello. Okay. So, let me move, mostly. There's a, hosp a hospital here called Premier. Premier Hospital. Ah, oh, greatly. So, there's a hotel here mostly that I usually eat some meals. They prepare very well, nice meals, African way. Also, the meat and other stuff. Last time I ate some shawarma here. It's an African shawarma, not even Indian shawarma. It's called shawarma, shawarma, behind me. On this side you see on there, they prepare some shawarma. So I'll kind of use this route, moving towards uh, the town, then from there I want to book an Uber. But I usually eat from this area called Coston, Coston Poa, Coston Poa restaurant. Let's go and uh, enjoy our meal. I will first say like the last meal in Mombasa. My bag is pressing me so hard. It makes me walk crazily. It's called Coston Power Restaurant. I usually eat over here. Let me eat, drink. I want to be full. Oh my goodness. Yes. Today my table is not kind of full. I want to sit on this area right here. It's okay. I want this for a quarter. This okay? So, guys, I'm, I'm uh, and juice. Which kind of juice? Uh, this is also passion, 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 tamarind, mango, tamarind, mango. Okay, the thing is, give me watermelon. Watermelon. Yeah, watermelon. Okay, thank you, bro. So I just reached at this place. Actually, it's one of my best restaurants. Actually, it's called uh, Coston Poa. It's based on Nyali Links Road. So I just ordered watermelon juice. They prepared just fresh meat juice and uh, some of uh, what you call like chicken, local chicken and ugali. And after that, enjoy. As I say, goodbye to this area. Okay guys, I just had my juice right here. Oh man, I do love their juice. It's actually typical natural, you know, very natural. You see, watermelon juice, lavugo, and watermelon. I don't know why I'm so thirsty with this watermelon. Very organic. Let me just enjoy uh, my last moments in Mombasa. Though I was not feeling much okay, my head was so bad. But uh, I thank God I'm healing each and every single day. Let me go have peace at home. Okay, nice. Oh, guys, so <laughs> my ugali is actually ugali. Uh, they just put small ugali, honestly. This is my small ugali right here. Some veg, I think this is spinach. And this is uh, chicken. And this food goes actually at uh, 800 Kenyan shillings. Typical expensive. So let's pray almighty God bless us with the food and we we'll take whatever energy to serve you. Amen. Okay. Let's dip in. We dig in this way. This is how you dig in, you know. African way. Okay. Hey, hey, hey. Then mm. I don't know why they brought these spoons. I don't know what are they made for. But uh, let me just enjoy my, my chicken. It's so hot. It's so hot actually. Mm. This is 
very hot. Actually, I've, I've been traveling and uh, one wise man in the villages in, in, Mali, in, in, in Asian country just told me, young man, before you die, you work so hard, but before you die, the best, 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 best gift you can give to your body is to make it healthy. Just eat. When you keep your body healthy, that's one of the best gifts ever. I don't know what he meant, but uh, let me try my best. I don't know these people. Like uh, they invented this because of lollipop. They saw this and invented lollipop. These are a local chicken actually. So sweet. So they saw this and they invented the lollipop. So lollipop came because of of the, the chicken thigh. Mm. I'm telling you guys, not a lie because of the chicken, but they, they invented chicken thigh because uh, they invented lollipop because of chicken thigh. Mm. True story. Hey guys, the meal was so nice. The meal was so nice. Now I have to to wash my hands and just see what next you know oh my goodness mm, just one fast friend to show that the gear is full and uh, yeah still have my luggage here and I have to fly saying goodbye to this area So guys, night train is one of the best. So I'm around here and uh, I'm definitely moving. So the train arrived here exactly at 8.30 or uh, 30 minutes to 9. That's when the train arrived. That's the standard gauge rate. And me, I'm now going to the capital city that is Nairobi Kenya and this is how you see the train just arrived and uh, these people are around here to, to just carry the passengers and ferry them to Mombasa now we coming they are going we going they coming that's how it is called you know Oh my goodness. So guys, I'm in this area once again in SGR from Mombasa. Now I'm heading to Nairobi, Kenya. Just checked in. As you see, stairs ahead, Queen Giangas in there. So we are heading up. And this is how we tend to see. So the kid is celebrating Mombasa. <laughs> okay guys. Okay. Just around. And I tend to show you. Let me go to the other side. In the front area. Let me see. Now I'm finally going on the other side. With my big bag. And uh, 
Yes, I'm going to board. I wanna see. What everything is.